we hosted a national debate tournament in my, in my freshman year. And then the debate coach said, uh, Sylvester, uh, we've got a, a team coming in from Chicago. I need you to go to the airport and pick them up. And he handed me his keys and he walked away. Uh, but he did not ask me if I knew how to drive. So I looked at the keys, looked at his car and said, what the hell? That was a miraculous experience. Uh, but that's when I learned how to drive on the campus of the University of Michigan. side of Houston. I grew up in Acres Home. My family is rather large, six boys and three girls, and I'm number six. My dad was a painter at Continental Imsco for nearly 30, 31 years. My mom was the maid at the Old Rice Hotel. I saw them work tirelessly. Uh, my dad worked until the time that uh, time he died, even after being diagnosed with cancer. My mom uh, picking up the baton, and uh, she became the CEO of the Turner household. As my brothers and sisters who were older than I got older and graduated from high school, they either decided to go into the military or they started working to assist my mom in taking care of the second half of the Turner clan, so to speak. I'm in the second half, so quite frankly, um, I'm indebted uh, for making it possible for me when I came through and graduated from high school and I'm going on to uh, some college or university. And I knew I wanted to be a lawyer. I came to the University of Houston for the debate program I was traveling quite a bit with the debate team. I spent a lot of time in the library, you know, a lot, lot of time. So when I graduated from the University of Houston, my next stop was uh, Cambridge, Massachusetts. While I was at Harvard, um, after my first year, a number of law firms were coming to the law school to interview students for summer clerks. I ended up going with uh, Fulbright and Jaworski in the city of Houston. They extended me an offer to come and work with the firm two years down the road, full time. I was real pleased with that offer. And then after being there for about three, three and a half years, I ran for the Harris County Commissioner's Court. I did not win. I came back to the law firms and they said, you're ready now to focus on the law firm? And I said, I certainly am. And I continued to, to do that for a while. And then I ran for the legislative seat in 89 and won. I left the legislature January 1st, uh, 2016. Ashley is my owner, Dawn, and she will tell you very clearly, she is the only one and now she's the director of a health and wellness nonprofit here in the city of Houston. Uh, my sisters and brothers um, have been very instrumental and very supportive. But we still assemble at the, at the family home, in Acres Home, uh, on all of the major holidays. But you can't write my story without including University of Houston. What I gained from the university uh, that enabled me when I went to Harvard to do well there. You cannot talk about me being in the legislature or talk about me being the mayor of the city of Houston uh, without giving a great deal of credit to the institution and to the people and the professors and the students at University of Houston. And getting this award is very special. Most people never get it. For the award to come from University of Houston is even more special. You know, you just try to do the very best you can and give back as much as you can to recognize me in this case and to, to bestow this honor means a great deal and for that I want to say thank you.